shoulder is going to send that jab. Like, you know, but you block it. Oh, that's not coming in. <laughs> that's what the body did. The body, we, we, we are one. We, and, then, and then when that body blocked it, the brain reacted. The brain reacted first through the eyes because the eyes saw the shoulder. You know? And we thought, we thought jab was coming, so we blocked it. All right, and then we, we, we protect the body. We're protecting the body. The body's being protected. All right, through the edifying. All right, it's a spiritual fight. Let me read this verse again. All right, from whom the whole body fiddled together and compact by that which every joint supplied for according to the effectual working. In it's in the measure of every part. So when brothers sit here, you talking that crap on those TV shows and those on those um things, we blocking that. Get that shit out of here. That shit's not coming through. You can't it can affect the flock. The ones that fall for it, fall for it. But the ones not gonna fall for it, they're gonna be protected. They're gonna understand that. Oh no, that's not what we was taught. <laughs> you know. Oh boy, right? It says that maybe it increases of the body unto the edifying of itself in love. So that that was just that block of you talking that crap about um, John the Baptist. It was the love. It was we had to feed, we had to feed the flock love. Like oh no 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 that's not no get away from the flock, get up out of here. That was spiritual. It's a lot for you. Because you're messing up the ones that could come in. But we ain't going to let you mess it up. The apostles is not going to let you mess it up for the righteous. And the brothers, the elder brothers is coming up. They're not, they're not here. They, they know the scriptures. We know the scriptures. That's why we don't got the bag. We, we got bill problems. We ain't got no... We, wait, hold on. Hold the hell up. We got all types of bags, all types. Of, I'm trying to know that motherfucker. Com I mean, comfy locked up, right? He had all types of bags. He had buses with his name on it and all the type, whatever. Man, I don't know. I seen some shit. I seen him walking around with some girl. Well, I didn't see him in person, but you see the videos. Come on, man. It's crazy. All right? You got it. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> You have been paid. I ain't got no money. I can't lay back in the shade with lemonade. All right. Oh, that was that one. Let me see. I'm just looking at a verse. Okay. So they not going they not they don't want they ain't trying to get saved, so they don't they're trying to mess up the ones that are gonna be saved, but you're not gonna be able to deceive the righteous. You're not, not with that madness. That's crazy. Brothers ain't nobody following the Lord said follow me. He ain't said follow General General Johanna. Now, I remember I ran to an individual, and I did, you know, disrespect, you know, because here they, they are teaching some type of formal truth, but they're not teaching the formal truth because they got a glitch. The glitch is the 501c3 charter. That's a glitch in the, ma in the, um, in the matrix. We see the glitch. We know you're getting paid. All right, so I ran to this one guy, and I did, you know, I, I, I said, I know you, blah, 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 blah. We was talking, I said, and then I said to him, I said, yeah, General, General Gehena, and I called him out his name, you know, to him. And he said, why you, why you call him that? His name was Gehena. And that was a long time ago, now it's 2020. <laughs> Wait, hold on. 
we 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 respecting the we respecting Yahweh Shemel Shah through the spirit of Yahweh Shemel Shah. But if you're gonna disrespect Yahweh Shemel Shah, he you're not gonna get saved. This first go around, you're gonna come back as our babies. But it, it, oh, I wasn't trying to kind of call him by his name. I was just that was just a, a you know to see if if I could you know get him to understand it, but. You know, all respect. Yes, General Yohanna. But then the Apostle of the Heart says, Yohanna is not a word. So it's not, um, it doesn't have meaning. So I don't know. I'm learning. But then I looked it up, and then I said, wait a minute. It, it makes sense. You know? You start looking up stuff, and then you realize, wait a minute. This is, you know, this word means this. This word means that. Because, you know, we got the, um, the translator, if you put the words in it, it'll break it down and, and it'll come into a, it will form a word in Hebrew or Greek. So none of it is hidden. And and then oh slap you. <sighs> the um the Urim and the Thurum. The lower grade of your the thumb is the cell phones and all this other stuff that that's in there perfectly fitting in there through the through the, through the um, memory chips and all that stuff. That's how you know that you could it could, it could be glitched. It could be a, it could be a, a malfunction in it because it's not fully controlled by the mind of the one that's that's doing the controlling of this cell phone. Now, we don't get the full control of our mind. There's something, th there is a perfect power. And there's, a, there's the, uh, this world is imperfect. This, there's nothing perfect about this place. So I, I'm all over the place, but it was just in the spirit. All right, it says right here, it says, 2 Thessalonians chapter 2, verse 11. And for this cause, God should send them a strong delusion. And they are being, they, they, this, yeah, how what is going to send this, this delusion? Because how, you mean to tell me that y'all have this much problems with the scriptures when they be broken down, according, broken down word by word, y'all having problems with it. Oh, y'all taking that out of content. Wait a minute. If the word means what it means, how are we taking it out of content? You don't want to believe the word. So you are being, you are putting that delusion. Uh, that they might, that they shouldn't believe a lie. How made you believe the lie? You think I'm going to do with us? Yeah, how about Shemel Shah said, what? You don't, want, you don't want to take heed of my men, my prophets? Well, I'm going to see you to a reprobated spirit. You know? What is that? It's like you. So that's what happened. And I brought this out. That don't happen to me. I don't get pushed out into the outer darkness. Because in the darkness, you can't see that. Anything, anything you touch, you can think it's good. Oh, I finally found something. Like, come on, there's a goddamn... Man with, with with no eyeballs and, and a nice sword to right, chop you. <laughs> Anything to deceive you. Alright. And you people have been deceived. That's crazy, man. I mean, I mean, we coming out of the we coming out of the glitches. We trying to get the rid of, get rid of the glitches that was on us. <laughs> Just keep thinking like that, like the glitch. And then y'all taking the five o, y'all putting the ultimate glitch in the five o one c three job. Then y'all see what happened to Comfy when he got all that money. People wanted Comfy to go down so bad, he went down too. Comfort it down. All right, 
Ezekiel chapter 14, verse 9. If the prophet be deceived when he speak, when he spoken a thing, I the Lord hath deceived that prophet, and I will stretch out my hand upon him, and I and will so oh my goodness, what it says, let me read this again. Ezekiel chapter 14, verse 9. If because Yahweh Shimon Asha got you talking your crap. Just for us to have you as an, you an example of what we shouldn't be doing. Man, if, and if the prophet be deceived where he has spoken a thing, I, the Lord, Yahweh, have deceived that prophet, and I will stretch out my hand upon him. And will destroy him from the midst of my people Israel. He's going to destroy you if you don't. If you think you got it, the Lord put you like that. You ain't got it. That bag is the, the is the, is a is a deceiving mechanism from the Lord. Yahweh Shemal Shah put that money in your hand, made you take that money. It's like just like Judas Iscariot. Are you out of here? Can't go around that one. Forget about it. <laughs> Listen, we don't be trying to, we're not doing our own, own, we're not doing our own thing. Okay? We're not doing our own thing. Y'all doing y'all thing. Y'all doing y'all getting the new glitches, man. Crazy. <laughs> Um, Second Thessalonians chapter two, verse twelve. That they all might be damned who believe not the truth, but had pleasure in unrighteousness. Man, that's some. That's a serious thing. How about you now, shot Done it to you. Damn, man. It's like you can't go around these words. Like that's why they don't read the scripture because they start reading verses like that that the Lord made it happen. The Lord did it to you. Made you think, oh, you got that bag and you got some booty, big booty chick. You know, she's doing whatever she got to do to get some of that money. And, you know, women don't need a lot. <laughs> we give a couple of women a couple thousand dollars. They they go for like two, three weeks, month. They get their hair did and all that, pay their bills off, and then they out to get another batch of money. Oh, that's accurate. So... That's serious, bro. Oh, man, that's serious. Serious business, man. All right. It says, let me read that verse again. Second Thessalonians chapter 2, verse 12, that they all might be damned who believe not the truth, but had pleasure in unrighteousness. Man, oh, man. Did you hear all the other verses? That means, that means you don't have a chance. If you don't get, the, if you don't, if you don't, if you don't get back on that podium and apologize First and foremost, to John the Baptist, and then tell Yahweh Shemar Shah Salakia, oh, I apologize and for, for disrespecting one of your number your, one, one of your number one dudes. You out of here, bro. Ain't nobody listening to that shit. If somebody fall for that, then they just jacked up. All right, hold on. Look at this. It's, well, hold on, let me get a little bit of this because uh, this is going back. When they, your poppy was down with um the ones that went against Moses. Look what it says. Hold on, let me see, let me see something real quick. You're probably one of the dudes that went against Moses. So I just want I want to read this verse. Wait, hold on. 
just, I'm just gonna leave this because look what this says. Man, oh, jeez. I don't want to be you dudes. <laughs> I don't want to be you dudes, man. I don't want nothing, man. I better, if I get a couple, if I get through the day and get some money, I get a couple of dollars, man, and make a run around how I was running around yesterday, I mean, last night, just from all day, Sunday, yesterday, Sunday, going to Monday. Of running around trying to get a couple of dollars, knowing that I gotta pay my damn bills. You know, way behind, you know, way behind on bills and shit. And you motherfuckers got big ass bags. You should got that bag. You should just distribute that shit to everybody. But you know what? Even in the in the, in the industry, they can't distribute all that money. They get oh no, don't go back to the niggaville. Don't go back to Jay told Jay Z. Don't go back to Marcy and give none of them niggas no money. Don't make no friends with the back. Don't try to make. Don't get no. They your enemies. You you give them that money, you our enemy. That's what the elite told them. So he told you the same thing. Kofi didn't stop nobody when he got that money. He didn't stop the truth. His ass in jail. <gasps> His ass in jail. All right. Deuteronomy chapter 32, verse 7, 30, verse 35. To me belong his vengeance and recompense. Their feet shall slide in due time. For the day of their calamity is at hand. And the things that shall come upon them make case. You got it. It's, man, it's going to come so hard on top of you for that. You, you might be worse than comfy. At least might take you so you ain't do nothing. I want you to do that. What I the money I gave you. I run down on you. Do the spirit of Yahweh Shemel Shaka. Yahweh Shemel Shaka control both sides. Don't forget, Yahweh Shah said, "Give me back the power that I had when I was when I was with you, Yahweh." Roughly paraphrasing. So we asking Yahweh Shah, give us back the power when we was first with you. When we was making the galaxies. When we left our first estate. You're going to come back as our babies, man. And we're going to raise you right. I'd like to give all prayers and honors and glory to Yahweh Shemel Shah by Shemel Karkotas. Why are you about Shemel Shah for giving us the apostles and that was a great millstone? Shalom.